gosh. Oh no, get out of my house. Get out, okay. Oh, somebody in the comments has told me about the weapon cooldown. So, oh, there we go, we killed him. Uh, so the weapon cooldown, so I am trying that out because I used to just, um, in the past episodes, just spam click and apparently that worked really well in previous versions of Minecraft, but not now. This is Sheeta's Craft and I just wanna say welcome to another episode of Vegetarian Vanilla Survival. Woo! So you may notice that we are actually on our new house, which I'm going to be honest with you guys, I'm not totally in love with from the front. So we definitely need a lot of revisions to be done. This isn't finished. I think maybe I'll even tear the whole thing down and start over. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys. So this is our little um, bungalow on the beach. I haven't put in any support structures yet. So I'm just waiting to figure out exactly what I want to do with the house. I did have to use creative mode for just a bit on this um, just to help me get these little stairs because I didn't want to use birch but that's pretty much it everything else was um, a ton of hours of shearing sheep and <laughs> chopping down a bunch of oak trees and then even a couple birch trees and then grabbing up a ton of sandstone and making some and that just took forever and then up here, we've got our little upstairs, which is kind of empty. Uh, we had a ton of sand that we had to deal with. We've got our little fake bed right here. We've got to get our real bed put in soon. Uh, we've got a little balcony here so we can watch the moon. And then we've got another balcony here. And if we really wanted to, we could jump down in there. Over here, you can tell there's been a lot of landscaping added onto the beach. Um, huge shout out to a guy for coming in and helping me put all that together because it would have taken me so long. So I just felt like we needed a little bit larger of a beach. Now I kind of don't want to go out there right now because of that skeleton, but whatever, we'll be brave. So let's go downstairs. Oh, we've also got uh, this little porch here. So anyways, I'll show you guys the front in just a second, but I'm just not a huge fan of it. So I don't know what we'll do. Um, this might just have to last us for a couple of episodes until I feel like uh, making some changes. So this is the front. Um, it's just not, it doesn't really look like the picture that I had shown you guys a couple episodes back. So we'll see what we're going to do. If anybody has any suggestions for how to make it a little bit more like a little Bora Bora or Maldives bungalow, please let me know. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I'm realizing that I, oh my gosh, that I do not have enough um, wood to even make a bed. So <laughs> I need to chop down some wood, but this is, oh my God, oh my God. This is, I, I, okay, I don't think we should do this. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, hurry. Oh my gosh, can everybody see this right now? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mobs over there, and then at least two over there, and then a bunch of creepy um, skeleton horses and squids in the water. So right now, I think we are pretty screwed. Um, let's, I guess, kill a spider. Okay, oh, I'm scared, I'm really scared. All right, there we go. We killed one mob. All right, let's figure out, oh my gosh, I do not wanna be here right now. All right, let's go get this guy. Is he not, is he not, ho oh, yes, he is hostile. Okay, all right, I guess that works. Or is he, oh, nope. Don't you, get away, go. Our diamond armor is holding up pretty well right now. Okay, where this is, I'm so bad at this. That's enough for a bed. That's enough for a bed. I wanna make a daylight, I'm gonna make a daylight. Oh my gosh. Ah, no, this is so scary. Oh, uh oh, I hear somebody. Sorry if I'm really quiet while I'm fighting. I'm just trying to focus. No, oh, oh God, I'm not even getting any hits on him. Oh, we got a bow, awesome. It's daytime. See what's going on with all the mobs. The creepers are still here. Nope, oh no, oh, this pretty sand that I just built. This is probably a stupid idea, stupid idea. No, <laughs> get away, get away. Don't you dare blow up this area. Don't you do it, get away. Get away from me. <laughs> just going in circles. Oh, you guys have left a huge mess for me to clean up. Nope, don't, do not do it, uh-uh. Oh, oh my gosh, oh, so cute. Hi, <laughs> hello there. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> that makes me really sidetracked because we definitely need to get an ocelot for our home. I am going to actually plan on doing a little bit of palm tree building today. So I'm gonna figure out what style I want to do that in and then we'll, we'll get started. Uh-oh, 
I'm in the middle of chopping down some trees for wood. And we've got this guy. Ah, get out of here. Get out of here. I don't know much about the cooldown, but I know there is one. So I'm trying not to spam click. All right, are we ready? Oh my gosh. He's kicking our butts. <laughs> Ooh, an apple. Ooh, another apple. I spy something gray and something purple. Yeah. Ah. No. There we go. I don't know if I'm doing this. Oh, cool. Oh, we got um, an enchanted power wood bow. Those are so creepy. Like every time it storms, which is going to be a lot here because we're in, um, I think it's, yeah, we need to go home. Um, they're going to be coming out all the time. Oh my gosh. Why are there so many of these guys? Seriously. Let me get back home. So we might end up trying a couple different styles of palm trees and then we need to do some leaves around it. So let's go ahead and get our base going. And I'll probably go through just this one with you guys and then build a couple others at like a speed build or something. Okay, so that's our base for that. So let's, let's get this here. Alrighty. And then we need to go, how should we go? We're definitely gonna go up right here, I think. Let's go here. And then we'll just go ahead and go all the way around out one more and then we'll go down. Um, you know what? I don't know if I like these leaves. I don't know if I like that or not. Okay, so I'm getting places. Don't worry about my little stairs. It's just so I can get up higher to um, get rid of the stuff that I don't want. There we go. Let's come out another one and um, we'll go down. All right, so now we've got our four sides. So then we're going to want to build um, a little bit more like coming out of the diagonal. So um, yeah, I think that works. Yeah, I don't think that's too bad. Yeah, it's kind of frustrating that I can't. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> So we've got our first palm tree. Let me get rid of this. So it's okay. I don't really know why these leaves are a different color than those leaves, but oh well. Um, <laughs> he's kind of sad. <laughs> I think I might try a couple different styles um, all around this area. So I guess what I'll do is put this on just uh, fast forward for you guys um, and build a couple different ones and then I'll figure out which one I like best.
All right, everybody, I've spent a lot of time building one, two, three, four, five, six palm trees, and we've got some that are curved, we've got some that are tall. I am <laughs> kind of like over building for right now. I think I'll probably finish up the rest off camera. I might even take down that big tall jungle tree there um, and put up some more palm trees, but I want to leave enough space so that we can have maybe a cute little beach town and do like a little surf shack and maybe some sort of um, ice cream truck, something really cool like that that I think would be really, really cute. So that's why I don't want to make it too populated. Just um, like the amount I have over there is probably the same amount that I'll do over here. Let's get a hoe and then we will make our farm. So here we go. I've got our water in, so that should hopefully help um, with this stuff here coming back to dirt. So we've got that. Um, okay, I think that looks like a pretty decent farm so far. We'll go to sleep in just a second. Now, one thing I definitely want to do is get some carrots growing so that we can have some golden carrots because that is really, really, really good for hunger saturation. So, ooh, let's get some carrots. And then we'll do, I guess, also one row of potatoes as well. So that'll be good. You know what? I really would like to get a horse. And I'm wondering if we can get that guy. Although I feel like that's kind of weird to have <laughs> a skeleton horse. It's currently just the only one we have. Um, and we don't have any leads, so we will have to lock him in somehow wherever we go. So let's see if Mr. Skeleton can be tamed and loved and ridden and all those good things. Now, oh, come on. Come on, he's like see-through. Oh, it's so weird, gross. He's like disgusting. I'm sorry, did I hurt your feelings? Okay, so I'm right-clicking him and it doesn't look like I am able to ride him or like do anything with him. So we are just gonna kill him. <laughs> I don't think that this is a... <laughs> It's animal cruelty because he is a skeleton. Um, I just find him generally gross. I mean, he doesn't even drop meat. See, he drops a bone because he's all skeleton. So there's no meat on him anyway. So that does not break our vegetarian rules. If you guys have any ideas for what we can do in the near future, please let me know because I want to make sure that you guys are enjoying this series. Well, one of them is going to get in the boat. Okay, so it looks like that's how it works. So... <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so cute! <laughs> oh, that's adorable! <laughs> We've got our little pig in our boat. <laughs> Whee! Woo! Okay. <laughs> I made myself dizzy. Oh, we found a wolf and some chickens. Oh, I have one bone on me. Let's see if he can be tamed with a single bone. He looks really scary. Oh gosh. Oh, are you nice? Oh. Oh, oh, darn. But maybe this guy, if I kill him, since he sounds like a skeleton, is that him? Or no, I think there's just a skeleton in a cave. Okay, so he's angry. We're not sure why. Alrighty, right in front of our old home, I have found some horses. So I think that my favorite one is this spotted horse. Please, please, please. Oh, okay, perfect. Let's see if you are fast. See what the deal is with you. I guess you're pretty speedy. Oh, he's not angry anymore. <laughs> okay, so I don't think I can put the horse in the boat. So what I'm going to have to do is um, <laughs> just try to get him across manually. Got him all the way back here and it took me a really, really, really long time. And now he is back. So now we have a horse and I've stuck him in a hole for now because I just don't know where else to put him. Uh, but anyways, guys, it has been a very long night of hours and hours of gaming for me. I hope you guys did enjoy this palm tree building and horse expedition and mob fighting episode. It was a lot of fun. A lot of work went into it. So be sure to smash that like button and subscribe and comment down below if you have any suggestions for any future episode content ideas. So I will see you guys soon. Bye!